Welcome to Querétaro, Mexico. We're here visiting AMD because they manufacture unique automation systems that keep car factories running around the world. Let's go talk to Juan who helps keep the business running. If you're making automation equipment for the automotive industry, you have some ridiculous requirements placed on you, Juan. Now, it's an amazing business you've got here. What kind of components do you make? We, we build automation machines. That's pretty much what we do. Uh, all the way from assembly to inspection and all the steps in between, we automate those, those needs and we build machines for that. Absolutely, and here we are in the manufacturing cell. Um, and the kind of components that you need to manufacture in-house um, for those automation cells, you could subcontract those. Yes, uh, I'm gonna take a step back and talk about the, 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 the reason why we started manufacturing ourselves. So at the beginning, we, we subcontracted everything and just our customers, our, our suppliers, sorry, couldn't deliver the quality we needed. So we had, to, we had to do it ourselves. So we started buying track machines to assemble those components. Why? Because there are two different particularities for, for the, with the components that we, we need to manufacture those machines. And the first one is a very high degree of quality. So we have to be, it has to be very, very precise. And the second one is you only make one-offs and maybe two parts per component. And that's it. We don't do any scale production or mass production. So our machines have to be very, very flexible to accommodate that type of manufacturing while maintaining the quality, which is a, which is a challenge. You're trying to do both at the same time. Exactly. Um, you need the quality. Why do you need the quality? What does that result in, in your end, for your end users? Yeah. Automation equipment needs to be very, very precise. If we, don't, if we don't have quality components going into those machines, we're, they're never going to work. So. It all starts with the raw materials, and Absolutely. in this case, it's the parts. Yeah, and if these parts don't come out right and they don't, those automation machines don't work, you imagine these machines are, they're doing lots of different jobs, but yeah. they do those jobs every single day for exactly. years, mm -hmm. absolutely years. Yeah, yeah. They have to work, some of our machines have been in service for more than 20 years, uh, in Mexico, Japan, the US, some of, some of them are in Europe, and they have to be able to keep on going and keep on working. And normally when you're making kind of prototypes, one-off, twos-off, this normally takes a long time to turn those around from I've got a drawing to I've got a finished component. Yes, yes. Lead time on our parts is critical. If we, if we take a long time building those, those components, we won't deliver the machine on time and our customers are always in a hurry. So having the ability to manufacture it ourselves and have very, very short lead times, it's crucial for our business. These machines allow us two things. Number one, we can program the machine with a computer. Or if it's a very simple component, we can just program it on the side of a machine using that control. So it just allows for incredible flexibility and to shorten those lead times. If we, our, some of our suppliers, which we, we also contra, subcontract some manufactured parts, they would take around two or three weeks to assemble a whole product. We can deliver these, the same, exactly the same those, those, of those components in a week because we have these machines. Absolutely, and I guess the, uh... There are knock-on effects of that for your customers, but there's also knock-on effects for the fact that your uh, operators can start to use these machines earlier rather than if they were you're trying yeah. to learn to use production CNC machines. Getting talent is a critical component in our industry, and we can't manage to have a new, a new person come in and learn a machine and take a year to start manufacturing parts. That just does not work. So these machines are very, very simple. So they take a lot of the skill of the worker out of the equation, so a new guy can pretty much be producing parts in two months, two or three months with these machines because they just simplify so much of the, of the process. And let's go see where these components get assembled into these fascinating automation machines. Juan, we're here in front of an amazing automation assembly. What does it do? I can't go into a lot of details regarding this machine. Very sensitive. Uh, it's sensitive information, but we inspect electric motors for one of the top manufacturers of electric cars in the US. Yeah, that's absolutely. what we can do. We, we, we check that the rotors and stratos are perfect. Yeah, and there's a lot of precision that's required in these, these components themselves, which means the machinery itself has to be very precise. Yes, yes. All of our components need to meet very tight, specific uh, dimensions and, and quality requirements. And we've talked about the, uh, the manufactured precision that you make on the track machines, on your manufacturing house, but when you assemble it, that's when the precision really takes effect, yes. right? Yes, yes, yes. We, our machines have to be perfect to manufacture good components so that our guys don't have to stop and re reassemble things. And realign stuff and clock exactly, it up. Exactly. It means that this needs to go, go together first time and needs to go together, together well. One of these machines can take up to four months to assemble. 
and if at the end you, you discover that this, there's an error in a part, you have to deassemble a lot of stuff and that takes time and costs money. Yep. And if you couldn't produce good components on track machines with the right precision, you wouldn't assemble it on site and it worked yeah. first time. Yeah, it would, be, it would be a mess. Yeah, for sure. Absolutely. So that's, that's AMD making unique automation systems, keeping the autom automotive industry running uh, with some components made on track machines. Absolutely fascinating company. Get in touch with these, these guys and check out track machines for your one-off, two-off, no matter how precise they need to be.